Hi, it's Andrea from Envision Partnership. In this video, I'm going to show you how to claim your mileage costs through Xero. I'll be working on the basis that you're using a private vehicle. A company car attracts different rates and as very few people now have company cars, <clears throat> I'm going to leave that for the purpose of this video. When you're calculating your mileage, you can claim back 45 pence per mile for the first 10,000 miles, and then 25 pence per mile after 10,000 miles. I'm now going to show you how to raise an invoice for the mileage. <clears throat> In Xero, there is a section for expense claims. I wouldn't recommend using that for these purposes. Expense claims are more for if you have a company with several employees making expense claims. It's much easier and quicker for you to raise a bill. So we'll go to business and bills to pay and new bill. And I'm going to put from as monthly mileage. Today's date, we have to fill in a due date. So I'm going to give myself a few days to pay myself back. And in the description, I'll put mileage for September. I did 100 miles for the unit price of 45p per mile, as I'm still under the 10,000 miles. For the account, in our demo, demo company, we have a mileage account. You can also charge it to Travel National. For this example, <clears throat> our demo company is not VAT registered, so we don't need to worry about the VAT. If you are VAT registered, there are different rates of VAT that apply depending on your vehicle. So please talk to us before you raise an invoice. I'm now going to approve the invoice. And that's all ready. I can now go ahead and repay myself the 45 pounds. And when I go to the bank reconciliation, I can match that payment to this bill. For your record, you will need to keep a record of your journeys. You should note down the date, the starting point and destination and the number of miles. You could use a notebook and keep it in your car or a spreadsheet or there are apps you can use that track your mileage. You'll need to keep these records for at least five years. And that's how you add mileage to zero.